Hey guys, what's up? This is Hamad2424. Um, in today's video, I'm going to give you all a tutorial on how to flash the Android Lollipop 5.0 on your Nexus devices. Uh, this process can be implemented on Nexus 7 both editions, even on the Nexus 4 and Nexus 10. So it's a pretty easy uh, tutorial. Uh, I know uh, waiting for the OTA everyone gets frustrated and all so thought of making a video on how to give a tutorial to all to all of you who think that doing all this stuff is really hard and you might break or like un break your phone or something like that so this is really easy you just need to download the flash uh, the factory image uh, from the google factory uh, whatever there is called developer website whatsoever download it from there for your device whether it's a nexus 7 nexus 5 4 or the 10 so this is my tutorial on how to flash the 5.0 android lollipop on nexus 5 so stay tuned yes, here it is uh, i'm going to show you how to like flash the factory image on the Nexus 5 if you cannot wait for the OTA to come out so I used the Skipsoft toolkit to flash this um, factory image I'm going to give the link in the description below where you can download the toolkit from when you've done downloading it just double click it yes and a screen will pop up like this Make sure you you have all your ADB and fastboot drivers installed before doing this process. Otherwise, it's like useless. So, first, when you open it, you will see a screen like this. You will see devices, supported Nexus devices, which are Galaxy Nexus, Nexus 4, 5, 7, 7, 10. And I'm not going to review any of the Samsung devices because I'm not going to... I'm not a Samsung fan or something like that. So... As we move forward, you see the Nexus 5 number is 03. So press those button which your device is like if I would have would have want to flash a factory image on the Nexus 4, then I would choose the number 2. But uh, if you are a Nexus 5, 7 or 10, then choose the the number that the preferred number that is written. So I would write 03. 0 oh wait a sec 0 and 3 now when you have written that uh, make sure that your device is plugged in when you are doing this make sure that your device is plugged in before doing all this process okay and make sure that your device is unlocked the bootloader is unlocked okay when you press 0 3 just hit enter when you press enter a screen like this will come and it would then ask for an upgrade for this skips of toolkit whatsoever this is just hit yes enter it would take around uh, five minutes if you're opening this uh, toolkit for the first time not more than that la, 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 la. So, press any key to continue to get operation, blah, blah, blah. So, here it is. So, after that screen, you get a screen like this, okay? Now, what you have to do is press, is type 99, bypass, model, build, selection, and go to straight, blah, blah, blah. Just type in 99 and hit enter. When you hit enter, you'll get a screen like this, okay? You have all the option over here, install device driver. If you haven't installed any drivers, then hit one and then go and proceed to all those uh, uh, process. Okay, so first if your bootloader is locked, then you might have to first unlock it by clicking three. When you click three, it the process will automatically begin and you don't have to do anything your device would automatically the bootloader would be unlocked and the all and all the data would be removed so erased so make sure that you make a backup before unlocking your bootloader okay 
when that's done don't do don't do anything just click on 9 download extract flash google factory image rom mode server just type in 9 okay 9 and hit enter when you press enter you'll get on this screen it says download google stock image you don't have to do that okay you have to firstly download the stock image from the google factory image website and then when you open this when the screen comes oops sorry about that uh, wait a second okay when you are on this screen what you have to do is that just minimize this for just a second go to the drive where the skipsoft program is being installed like mine is on drive c and here it is unified android toolkit okay over here you'll see put google factory image here double click on it mine is showing nexus 5 because i have a nexus 5 yours might show nexus 10 4 or 7 just get double click on it and paste the factory image over here okay paste the factory image of android lollipop 5.0 over here okay after pasting it over here open this again and click and type in number two number two because you don't have to download any stock image because you already have downloaded it you don't have to press number three i don't know what that is you you just have to type in two if you really want android lollipop then you must type two after tapping in two just press enter you will get a screen like this it says no google stock images prints because i haven't like uh, pasted or anything make sure image is correct folder before trying it okay these are returning to flash man flashing menu whatsoever so this is how we install or flash factory image of android lollipop 5.0 after like when you have clicked to and when you hit enter everything every each and everything will look read here put google factory image here as i told you make sure it is in the google factory image nexus 5 folder as i told you over here that you have to copy it in the put google factory image here yes so as i was saying what was i saying i don't remember yeah when you press 2 everything each and everything will happen by its own you don't have to unplug the your phone you don't have to click or do anything when this process is going on just let it be and let it run and when it's done it will automatically erase all your all of your data before doing all of this stuff please make a backup because i'm i won't be like i don't know let's do make a backup and um and happy lollipop 5.0 on your nexus 5 and i hope this method works for all of you because it worked for me and i'm really enjoying my lollipop on my nexus 5 which is over here and i just love this lock, lock screen just check it out boom so this was my tutorial on the nexus 5 tutorial on how to flash the factory image so hope feel free to share this video to those who cannot flash the factory image and who cannot wait for the ota to come out so flash this on your nexus 5 7 4 or 10 and enjoy the nexus like i am about to enjoy lollipop so guys this is me hamad 2424 thanks for watching this video i hope this was useful and see you next time